In this video, we're going to learn how to return multiple values from a function in Python. The first thing we'll do is make a basic Python function to add together two numbers and return the single sum value. We'll have here def add for the function name. The function will have parameters x and y. We'll sum together x and y and store the results into a variable called sum, and then we'll return sum. Then down here, we'll call add, and we'll store the resulting return value into the variable total. We'll pass add 50 and 20. Then down here, we'll output total with print total colon and total. Then we'll save our program and run it. And we'll get here a total of 70, which is correct. Now to have this function return multiple values, we can separate them by commas. So for example, we could call this function add and subtract, and then we could calculate the difference in the function as well. We could have here difference is equal to x minus y. Then we could return the sum and the difference by separating those values with this comma. Then down here, we should call add and subtract and to store the values returned by the function into multiple variables, we can also use a comma. So here we could have comma and then diff to store the difference return value into the variable diff. Then down here, we could output diff with print diff colon and then diff. Then if we save the program and run it, we'll get both total and diff and both are correct. And to return more values, we could just use more commas. So we could call this function operations, and we could also calculate the product of x and y with product is equal to x times y. And then we could also return the product with comma product. Then down here, we could call operations, and we could store the third value returned into a variable called result. And then down here, we could output result. We could have print and result colon, and we could output result. We could save the program and run it. And now we'll also get the product. Now what's really going on when we return sum comma difference comma product is that we're returning a single tuple value. We could actually see this. What we'll do is store the return value into a variable called R. Then down here, we'll output R, and we'll also output the type of R. So we'll have here print and we'll call type and we'll pass it R. We'll save this and run our program. And now we can see we actually get back a tuple and the type of the return value is tuple. Here before when we had total diff and result, what was going on was something called tuple destructuring or tuple unpacking. Each of the items in the tuple were being assigned to a variable. So 70 was being assigned to total, and 30 was being assigned to diff, and 1000 was being assigned to result. So this is how we can return multiple values from a function in Python. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers.